what I've got here is the new Citadel painting handle, which we're going to unbox and have a look at. So, as I get older, I'm finding it harder and harder to get things out of the packaging. There we go. So, many people have made comments about how much this looks like the Pair of Agony. So, that's the motion on it. So, it'll come back into place. So, let's get some models. 25mm base. Thirty two mil base, forty mil base, but I think that is as high as it will go. Let's try it with one of the Test of Honor models from I based up one of my old Lord of the Legend of the Five Ring models. Yep, metals perfectly fine. Let's try the Warlord thin lipped bases. But that's because I held it in the top bit for the 40mm. Yeah, so yeah, gives you a good grip. Let's pop this dude back in. You can reach fairly well underneath. Yeah, this is a nice product. Mainly I'll be holding it in my left hand because I'm right-handed, but yeah. The slide appears to be magnetic and you've got metal bits here. Or is it? No, it's a, it's a spring. I can feel this. Yep, you can even see it when I do that. I don't know if you'd be able to get it all the way to 50 mil. The top bits seem to be when you want to hold a 40 mil model in there. Yep, and that doesn't involve revealing the spring underneath. I wouldn't try it with 50 mil because of the risk of snapping it. But yeah. £5 makes this a product that you can buy on a whim. But yeah, it's not. It's also weighted in that when you feel it, there's a weight to it. And it appears weighted in the base. So, yeah, it's a little top heavy, but there is a reasonable amount of weight to the handle so it won't tip over if you nudge it. You got a proper push it to get it to knock over, but even then, unless the model sticks well over the side, you can hold that in there or in there for an even tighter grip. The model is protected from falling over. But yeah, as a product, it is the cheapest, nicest paint handle. Does that unscrew? Yes, it does. And you ah, and you can see the springs underneath, right there. But that also means that you can screw this into a number of other things because that's a fairly standard fitting. Or you could screw this into other things if you want a Citadel doorknob. Uh, a number of people have made some very rude comments about these, uh, which I'm not going to repeat here. But in many cases, were actually quite funny. Um, as a product, yeah, I'd recommend it. I think it's the best value for money paint handle on the market. I've seen some of the wooden ones on Kickstarter. They are nowhere near as impressive as this. Uh, I'd pick this every time. It's a fiver, which means you'd probably be able to get it for four quid from a lot of um, discounters. In the States, it's eight dollars. Absolutely a good buy. If you've liked this video, hit like or subscribe. If you've got a strong opinion regarding paint handles, please leave a comment below. Otherwise, good gaming.